In Dub star Phaser has announced he's welcomed twins after sharing a sweet clip of the newborns on Sunday. The rapper, 36, whose real name is Richard Rawson, and his girlfriend Ashley Emma Havelin are already parents to daughter Ava Rose, who they welcomed in 2013. Taking to his Instagram stories, Phaser showed one tot sleeping soundly before zooming out to reveal both bundles of joy. The little ones, whose names or gender have not been confirmed, were wrapped up snugly in fluffy onsies, one white and one pink. The proud dad captioned the short clip with the heart and world emojis, implying his love for the new arrivals was all-encompassing. Phaser announced partner Ashley was pregnant in September and gushed that the couple had been blessed with twins. He told the son, it's double trouble, we have been blessed. It totally blew us away, we've been walking on air since we found out the news we are expecting twins. In January 2013, he began dating model Ashley Emma and just a few months later, they welcomed their daughter Ava Rose Rawson. It comes admit reports and dubs have landed a massive two-album deal with EMI Records, which is part of industry giant Universal Music. The band are said to be secretly recording in Michael Jackson's old studio after their huge comeback tour came to an end in December. A source told The Sun, the deal is massive for N-dubs and their fans. The insider continued, for years it looked like they were never going to reunite, but after the success of their tour they found themselves with multiple offers on the table. They are now signed to EMI for two new albums and are recording at Grouse Lodge Residential Recording Studios in Ireland, an hour outside of Dublin. The band is made up of Phaser, Dappy, real name Costadinos Contestavlos, 35, is cousin Chalissa. The End Doves tour which had mixed reviews from those who went to see them. While their sellout tour delighted their hardcore fans, the gigs were marred by tales of in-crowd fights and a cancellation due to Dappy losing his voice. At the start of December, their latest gig at London's O2 was beset with further woes as a source told Mail Online the band were 40 minutes late to take to the stage. The end Doves tour which had mixed reviews from those who went to see them. While their sellout tour delighted their hardcore fans, the gigs were marred by tales of in-crowd fights and a cancellation due to Dappy losing his voice. At the start of December, their latest gig at London's O2 was beset with further woes as a source told Mail Online the band were 40 minutes late to take to the stage. They said they were supposed to start at 9 p.m. but didn't come on until 9.40 p.m. Everyone was getting restless and there were multiple fights in the crowds. We told the stewards who had called police but there was glass on the floor and on a broken vodka bottle on the toilet floor as well. We actually left after a few songs because we didn't feel safe. 